Welcome back. If you're looking for a late summer getaway, we have our travel guest back with us this morning with a really great location. Kylie Yu is the best-selling author of the 30-Day Travel Challenge and a travel journalist. And we're talking Tulum this morning. What do you love about it? Well, it's gorgeous. It has white sand beaches. It's really hot actually right now as a digital nomad destination. Everyone's flocking over there to do their work from home in the beautiful scenic uh, rainforest. But it's also still a super popular leisure destination. Just a couple things you need to know before you go. You don't need a negative test to enter, but upon return, the U.S. requires a negative PCR test taken within three days of your return. So you could just arrange that with your hotel. Super easy. And when looking so for while, a, oh, sorry. Oh, when, sorry. Go ahead. When looking for a hotel, what do you suggest in Tulum? I love staying at the Aloft. It's affordable and it has a lot of luxury touches and it has this gorgeous pool on the rooftop. It's the highest point in Tulum. So you can see the rainforest, you wow. can see the Mayan ruins. And if you're trying to squeeze in a little bit of work, like I like to do, you can also have the fastest Wi-Fi in the area. So they've got this really cool, all-inclusive deal happening right now. It's uh, two people, $229 a night, but it includes all your food, beverages, and cocktails. Wow, we should do the show from there. Yeah, that would be great. <laughs> I would love oh, that. I want that. I was, they got a good club life too, right? If you uh, want to head out and have a little fun. Definitely. So you should head over to the Mia Beach Club. It's a day to night club. And if you're staying at the Aloft Tulum, you get a pass to this club anyway, so it's included. So all you got to do is park yourself on a day bed and everything's delivered to you. Uh -huh. Food, drinks, even souvenirs come to Sounds you, so so you good. while you're shopping. But at night, it turns into nightclub, so make sure to bring some nightclub clothing. And they have the largest wine cellar in Tulum and the largest craft beer selection. Wow. And it's International Beer Day today, so, so they could, you could celebrate in Tulum. <laughs> yeah, we got to head over there right now. Absolutely. That would be great. It doesn't look like a destination that you can take your kids, but can you? I have a son. Would he be able to go? And you can, maybe actually. You just have to choose, like, um, not maybe go to the beach club, but actually the beach club has kids area, so you probably just wouldn't stay for the night club. You'd stay for the day club. <laughs> the daytime. Yeah. And, and there are the ruins to check out, which are really cool as well. Tell us about those. Yes, that's perfect for the kids. You can't leave Tulum without checking out oh, the wow. Mayan cool. ruins. They're really stunning here because they sit on top of a cliff and it's overlooking the ocean. So after wow. you've done all your sightseeing, you can throw on your swimsuit or swim trunks and just take a dip into the ocean. So everything in one day. That looks like a Mayan beach resort it's back in the beautiful. day. Wow. Yeah, well, we yeah. get transported back. I love it. A little Tulum getaway for the summer. Uh, Kyla, thanks so much. It's good to see you again and we'll talk to you again later. Thanks guys. Take care.